Welcome to the Exodoku training video number 65. In this video, we will discuss the advanced puzzle solving technique called Avoidable Rectangle Type 2. This video has two prerequisite videos. First, you should watch the Exodoku training video number 62 titled Avoidable Rectangle Type 1. And second, you should watch the Exodoku training video number 46 titled Unique Rectangle Type 2 before you start watching this video. All the uniqueness puzzle solving techniques are based on the one solution rule. The one solution rule means for a Sudoku to be considered valid, it must have only one solution. This video is composed of three parts. The first part shows you how to find an avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern in, the, in a Sudoku puzzle. The second part shows you how the logic of an avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern works. And the third part is a set of practice exercises so you can master this technique. Consider the following Sudoku in progress. Searching for an avoidable rectangle type 2 is very similar to how we search for an avoidable rectangle type 1. When searching for an avoidable rectangle type 2, we are going to search each cell from left to right, top to bottom. We are only interested in cells having values set, which are currently being shown in blue. At each cell with a value set, we are going to search for an avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern. We begin our search. We have found an avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern now highlighted. The avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern is composed of four cells. Two of the four cells already has a value set shown in blue. The other two cells have candidates for the same number value in the opposite diagonal cell. In this example, cell 5 comma 8 has a value of 7. And in the opposite diagonal of the rectangle, cell 6 comma 6 has a value of 7 as a possible candidate. The same for cell 6, 8 having a value of 3. The opposite diagonal, cell 5, 6 of the rectangle, has 3 as a possible candidate. According to the technique, the possible 9 candidate must be set in either cell 5, 6 or cell 6, 6 in order to prevent a uniqueness problem. As a result, the kill zone is highlighted in red and the target candidates to kill are highlighted in dark red. Before we delete target candidates, let's consider the logic for how the avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern works. Let's assume cell 6, 5 has a value of 9 as shown. This means cell 5, 6 has a value of 3, and cell 6, 6 has a value of 7 as shown. But now we have a problem. There is nothing in the puzzle preventing us from switching the 3 and 7s in the 4 cells making up the rectangle to be this way. This means this layout of initial givens has two valid solution grids from this point in the puzzle. This violates the one solution rule. So we must conclude based on the one solution rule, there must be a 9 in either cell 5, 6 or in cell 6, 6. It is important to note all four green cells making up our avoidable rectangle must be values or potentially be values. If any of the four cells is a given, that is, is black in this puzzle, then the four cells do not make up a valid avoidable rectangle type pattern. We have one more final confirmation before we can remove the target candidates in our kill zone. As with all UR puzzle solving techniques, we must first confirm our unique rectangle does not violate the 2 by 2 by 2 rule. The 2 by 2 by 2 rule says the four cells making up our unique rectangle can only occur in at most two rows now highlighted, two columns now highlighted, and two blocks now highlighted. You cannot have a valid unique rectangle pattern if the four cells making up the rectangle occur in four different blocks. We remove the target candidates from the puzzle. Besides type 1 and type 2, conceptually any of the unique rectangle puzzle solving techniques can have an avoidable rectangle version. We must lean on the assumption that we have a valid puzzle. So we must conclude there can't be any set of four cells with the same pairs of values on the diagonal forming a rectangle showing up in our solution grid. We just assume in all cases having the possibility of ambiguity in our solution grid is not possible. Time to test what you have learned. 
Before we begin, please remember to take some time to support the Exodoku. Find the avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern in the puzzle. Identify the target candidates to be removed. Pause the video. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern. Here is the solution. Pause the video and find the avoidable rectangle type 2 pattern. Here is the solution. This completes the Exodoku training video number 65. Please support the Exodoku. Thank you for watching.